welcome to this short video introducing the TerraVM web-based UI. In it, we will introduce a simple test case for loading an northbound management API or RESTful API. The UI enables ease of use. It provides for simplification of complex test scenarios. More importantly, offers more flexible sharing options. In the use case today, highlighting the flexibility of the TerraVM UI, we will look at loading a RESTful API or north southbound traffic in an example scenario for NFP, communicating with the VIM. In parallel, we will load east-west traffic or tenant traffic, providing full test coverage on all available interfaces. Equally, the TerraVM can be used to emulate load on any device or appliance which has a RESTful API. It's flexible, templated use cases. So this example here is the cybersecurity database view. So for our use case today, we're going to upload a new test case, which includes the instruction set for the RESTful API. So quickly here, we create our new test case. So we'll add it to our category REST, and we'll browse and select the files we want to use today. These templated files and scripts um, can be requested from an FAE, or indeed, um, with people with good, strong scripting capabilities can write their own. So we import our test case, or the configuration file for our test case. Okay, and our test case has been uploaded to our TerraVM controller. Once the test case is loaded, we can see that there's a number of tabs that require some information. So the first tab here is to upload our file of RESTful calls. We'll do that quickly. So in this instance here, the RESTful calls that we're going to use um, are highlighted. So particular calls that will talk to Keystone or the identity module in, uh, in OpenStack, uh, Nova or Compute, where we actually post and request uh, a, a new VM. So once we have that, we can configure some additional options. So again, all these are flexible op options for the customer. So here, I'm going to simply edit and add the username, and I'm going to edit and add a password. The tenant applications essentially are the traffic that are going to go across the east-west. And again, in terms of configuration, we can emulate uh, a network around the neutron or the uh, device under test, physical device under test interfaces. Again, it's quite easy to configure and enable. So we can save that and begin the test execution. For those of you familiar with the Terra VM, we still have the full per flow analysis capability as part of our Java UI. So just in here, what we've done is created the emulated clients and servers, and more importantly, the applications which will speak to the northbound API. So quickly we can see here some of the HTTP requests. So here we have a security token requirement as part of accessing the OpenStack environment. And again, you can see here the implementation of those RESTful calls. Switching back to our HTML5 UI, you can see that we can provide a number of metrics. So how much throughput is on, on the northbound API, what uh, the performance is in terms of the tenant traffic. So here you can see there's 7.5 gig in the east-west. And again, the total throughput that the is being traffic being generated by Terabian. Thanks for watching.